Now I am going to discuss with the linear differential equation with variable coefficients. Okay. How to find out the linear differential equations? Linear differential equation with variable coefficient. In this, first of all, we are discussing about the linear differential equation. In the linear differential equations, the variables are two. One is the independent variable. Second one is the dependent variable. Okay, if we are taking x is the independent variable, y is the dependent variable. By using of these two variables, the general form of the linear equation is dy by dx plus p of x into y is equal to q of x. Okay, it is the one type of the linear equation. In the same way, suppose y is the independent variable, x is the dependent variable. In this, the general form of the linear equation is dx by dy plus p of y into x plus equal to q of y. In the same way, if we are taking any variables, t is the independent variable, x is the dependent variable. Just to, we are observing which is the independent, which is the dependent variable. Independent always in the denominator, dependent in the numerator. Then only the dependent, we are differentiating that function with the independent variable. Here t is the independent variable, x is the dependent variable means the general form of the linear equation is dx by dt plus p of t into x is equal to q of t. These are the linear equations with the independent and dependent variables. For example, we are taking one equation dy by dx plus y is equal to x. It is a linear differential equation with the independent variable x. Here, the variable coefficients are p of x is y coefficient is 1 that is equal to 1 q of x is equal to x. For the second example, dx by dy plus cos y into x is equal to sin y cos y. This is okay, here y is the independent variable, x is the dependent variable. This function is p of y, it is the q of y. Here p of y, q of r, y are the variable coefficients with the independent variable y. For the third example, dx by dt plus x is equal to e power t. This is also one type of the linear equation with independent variable t, dependent variable x. In this equation, x coefficient is 1. Here, what is the p of t? The function of t is 1. Function of q is e of t in the independent variable t. These are the differential, linear differential equations with the independent and dependent variables. Okay, how to solve the differential equation which is in linear form. Okay, how to solve linear differential equation with variables x and y. The following steps are the major steps we have to follow then we are finding the solution easily. First step is the general form 
of linear differential equation is dy by dx plus p of x into y is equal to q of x. The given equation is comparing with the linear differential equation first of all. In the second step, in the given equation, what are the functions with variable coefficients? We write down p of x and q of x. In the third step, for the general solution, we are finding the integrating factor. The integrating factor formula is the short curly denoted by if e power integral of p of x into dx. The last step, the general solution of given linear differential equation is y into integrating factor is equal to integral of q of x into integrating factor dx plus c. These four steps are the major steps. If we remember these four steps, then we can solve the linear differential equation easily. Okay? For example, we are taking one question for the solving of linear differential equation. The first example of the linear differential equation is dy by dx plus y is equal to x. Let it be equation 1. This is the given equation for the solution. Equation 1 is comparing with linear differential equation. Here p of x is p of x is 1, q of x is equal to x. First step is comparing the equation with the linear differential equation. Second step is what are the functions p of x and q of x. Third step is we have to find out the integrating factor. The integrating factor formula is e power integral of p of x dx. It is equal to e power integral of 1 dx. e power x. Why? Because integral of constant dx is equal to cx. That is the integration formula. Next, these values applying in the general form. What is the general form? The general solution of the given differential equation which is in linear form is y into integrating factor is equal to integral of q of x into integrating factor dx plus c. Here what is the integrating factor y? Integrating factor is e power x is equal to integral. What is q of x? x is the q of x. Integrating factor e power x dx plus c. This integration is solved by the method of integral of u v form. Here what is u? Algebra is u, exponential is v. The formula of integral u v dx is u into integral v dx minus integral u dash integral v dx whole dx. This is the formula. Applying in that u is x. Integral of e power x is e power x minus derivative of x is 1. Integration of e power x is e power x. Again, that integration. It is equal to x e power x minus 1 into e power x is e power x. e power x integration is e power x plus c. Therefore, The general solution of given equation 1 
is y into integrating factor e power x is equal to x e power x minus e power x plus c. It is also in this e power x taking common e power x into x minus 1 plus c. It is the solution of the given differential equation which is in linear form. Here integral of e power x dx is e power x derivative of x is equal to 1. Thank you.